Are you packing? Does your dick float in the bath? Does being chubby matter? What are your biggest turn-ups? Can you control your erection? Makeup or no makeup? What's good YouTube? Welcome back to another video and today we are filming our very requested video. Today we're going to be talking about... What are we talking about? <laughs> Today we're going to be talking about what girls are too afraid to ask guys, but I'm not alone. We have a special guest, so let me just move over because I've got my uh, my auntie with me. She's not really mine, she's my sister. Yo, let's go! We're going to get right into the video, so... <gasps> Hold on. So before we get into the video though, if you are new around here, you have five seconds to smash that subscribe button. You ready? Five, four, three... Two, one, woo! If you did smash that subscribe button, welcome to the family. We love you. We've got nothing else to do. Let's just get into the video. Okay, so I asked you guys on Instagram a couple of days ago to ask me questions that you're too afraid to ask. Ask. <laughs> that you're too afraid to ask guys, your boyfriend, your brother, your dad or whatever. So I'm going to do it for you. But listen, I'm not going to be the one that's reading out the questions. You're gonna be reading out the questions, so uh, we're just gonna roll with it, man, and see where it goes. So, can a guy and girl be just friends? It depends how close they are, you know. Can't be like best friends. Why? Because yeah, if I'm dating a girl and she has a best friend that's a guy but he's straight, it's a bit weird, isn't it? Is that not weird? Is that a bit weird? Come on now. Personal you... preference. I wouldn't like it. Yeah, I wouldn't like it either. But I mean, it all depends. It all depends on the people, I guess. How hard do you stalk girls' social media pages? What me? Mm. Quite hard. How I'm deep single? Do you go? Oh, so now if I'm chatting to a girl, I will go quite deep to be fair. How long should you date before having sex? Doesn't matter. All depends on the time. If you guys feel right to do it, then. Go for it. Yeah, is that what I'm saying? Yeah. You agree? Yeah. How often do guys really watch porn? Personally, or like just normal? I don't know. When I was younger, probably like every day. What? You girls watch Sexu porn too, you know? Some sexually frustrated kid over here. Nah, but personally, I don't really watch it that much anymore. You know, I what do you first notice about a girl? A smile and her eyes. That's me, and then it's personality. I don't know, it's all about personality for me. It's not about looks, to be honest. Listen, you could be the best looking girl in the world, but you can have the driest chat ever. Am I right? Mm -hmm. You've got to have some sort of personality about you. Would you take a girl back if she cheated on you? Hell no. Nah. Clearly wasn't good enough to be in the first place. So if you're going to cheat, then there was clearly something missing in the first place. So why would I take you back? Mm -hmm. Dumb. Don't ever think that. And I expect it from the other way though as well. I wouldn't expect. Listen, most of you girls take back boys after they cheat. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, would you? No. Because there's clearly something missing. Mm -hmm. There you go then. No girls. offense to people that do, but girls, I ain't don't got do a mug. It. Yeah, I'm don't do it because it, it's not a good look, okay? So if he cheats, get rid of him. He wasn't good enough. What is the best and worst thing about being a male? I don't know, I guess the best thing is like height, isn't it? Height? <laughs> yeah. I could think something else. Ah! Uh, I'd love to be a guy for a day. Because I got a winky. Mm -hmm. yeah, Windmill yeah, that winky. Yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> I guess, yeah. I Every guess. girl would say that. I guess. Makeup or no makeup? No makeup. Not on you, on girls. Yeah, no makeup. You're naturally pretty, man. It's the way forward. Listen, if you're not confident, yeah, wear makeup. But I mean, it's not that deep. You girls got to appreciate your natural assets about yourself, man. You got to love yourself before you love anybody else, okay? Thoughts on padded bras? I don't know. You're not a boob person anyway are you? It's not like, no I'm an ass boy. If it makes the girl feel better then it doesn't really bother me because I ain't got nothing to do with it. I'm not buying them. Real or fake tits? Depends how big they go. Personally I don't like fake tits. They Quite don't weird move. isn't it? I like the jiggle. <laughs> Brilliant. Yeah I don't know I don't really mind man. Like I said it's all about her confidence so. I'm such a good lad man. Oh my god I'm so how nice. How are you single? Tell me about it. Instagram's gonna be like over my face. <laughs> Does sex on a first date mean she's not girlfriend material? Takes two to tango, but I don't know because in my mind if a girl sends like nudes or something really early or some shit without me even asking, it's like how many boys has she sent that to? She's saying you ask. No, I don't ask for nudes. But so if I went on a date with a girl and we ended up sleeping together, it's like, yo, does this girl do this all the time? And she probably could have the same thoughts about me. So I guess not. I guess the best thing to do is just wait. What are your biggest turn-offs? 
smoking, a girl that could probably eat more than me. Just because if I'm at dinner, yeah, and she's ordering yeah, two plates, I'm ordering one, like, that's a bit raving. No one can eat more food than you, so that's Yeah, that's impossible. true. Nah, if they smoke, like, cigarettes, like, every single day, then obviously it's not for me, but, I mean, I'm guessing there's always ways around it, you know? Not everybody can be perfect. Would you ever wait until marriage? For, to have sex? Mm. Nah, boys got needs. <laughs> yeah, exactly, you gotta know what you're getting. Imagine waiting until marriage, and then, She's absolutely dry. Not in that way. Do periods gross out guys? Natural, isn't it? Yeah, it's a natural thing and... Nah, you know what? Nah, nah. It doesn't gross you out. It's just a bit... Obviously, not growing up with like a woman in the house to me, it's a bit different. You know, mm. like obviously I'm not used to that. I'm not used to seeing that shit around, but it's just a natural thing, I guess, and just gotta deal with it. As long as you don't do it on the face. Moving on. <laughs> Does weight matter? I don't know, man. It all depends. It honestly, all depends. But I just, I don't know. To some people, it does. To some people, it doesn't. But to you? But to me, not really, no. I'm not that close. Are you packing? Depends what type of packing we're on about. Not fucking packing your suitcase. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> I, I'm not packing my case right now. Shaved or not? <laughs> don't mind the little landing strip, to be honest. <laughs> nah, me, bald from the eyebrows down. Calm. <laughs> Does your willy float in the bath? Yes. At the start, yeah, it like goes up a bit and then it Bobs. drowns. <laughs> but I don't really have baths, so... How important is your friend's opinion when it comes to liking a girl? Very important because they can kind of see everything from like an outsider's point of view. You know, you know when they say like love is blind, yeah? Mm -hmm. But your friends can see what's going on but you can't see. That's why you need your friends there. But I mean, to like the girl, yeah, because if they don't, it's going to make it really awkward. Mm -hmm. But you got to do what's best for you and how you feel. Yeah. Your friends might be too overprotective. That's that's true. That's true. Is there a size that you think is too big for boobs? Probably G's. How big's a G? Very. Yeah, I don't know because they are like pillows, aren't they? I mean, D D's are calm. Like D's are nice. Yeah. Are you gay? Bro, everybody thinks I'm gay. Like I'm pretty sure you even think I'm gay sometimes. No. You know what it is? It's because I don't have a girlfriend and I haven't had a proper girlfriend. I don't think ever. Not a proper one. Never not one that's one home. When I had a free house, girls would come round. It's a bit different for me bringing a girl home now because it's like, I can't really trust mm. them at the minute, but no. Do boys get upset just as much as girls? Yes. I think I think we don't get upset in front of girls, but we do it like alone when we feel like we need to do it. Where you girls are just start like bawling out crying. <laughs> well, you're not though. You do yeah. that, you know. If you're, like, you're upset, you kind of just say how it is. But boys, we kind of just like do it alone and do it in like our free time where nobody really knows. Do you live alone? No. I live with. I'm, I'm not brother. his mom. I'm not his girlfriend. I'm not his auntie. I'm not his nan. I live with Danielle. I'm a brother. And you know what? It's super chill. But that will conclude today's video, guys. Listen, if you do like the feature, please drop a big thumbs up because you never know. We could be like doing more stuff again. You might do my makeup one day. I'm training eyelashes. I'd love no. to get my hands on your lashes. Thousand likes. And we'll do it because it's quarantine. So you know Deal. what I'm saying. Deal. Thousand likes. That good. Thousand likes. We'll do that. Okay, but listen. On, guys. Anyway, we're so close to 10k. So go and smash that subscribe button because we're almost there. It's, it's gonna be below. Go and smash it. I'm giving away an iPhone, and the link's gonna be below. So if you wanna win a brand new iPhone, it's gonna be right there. Ten pounds to enter. Would you enter? Yeah. There you go, yeah. Anyway, if you did enjoy the video, smash the big thumbs up button. And guys, back next week with another video. So.